Hi, hi, our RMPS. It's Miss Manning here. So I'm going to give you three videos, and this is on the skills for higher RMPS. We have come to the stage now in the course where we have enough content to be able to start thinking about essay skills. So there's three different documents that I'm putting up on the files page. There's this document here, which talks about the skills, and I am going to go through that, not every single bit of it in this video, but I am going to go through that. Then the next video is going to be about this Word document, which is quite handy. It's talking about the skills as well, but what's good about this one is there's examples for you and also sentence starters for you to think about and basically just learn for your structure for when you do your essays. And then after that, I am going to talk you through a 20 marker model answer. OK, and where you can see where the marks are. So. Higher RMPS, otherwise the question paper, otherwise known as the exam. I'm going to give you some information about this. Also, before I go on, I want you to listen to this, take notes. You might need to listen to it a few times. Uh, potentially. But the main thing is I really don't want it to cause any anxiety. I want it to be like, all oh, right, OK, skills for higher RMPS. I can do this. I can absolutely do this because you definitely can. Um, it's really not too complicated. It's a formula to learn and then working out how to do it and then doing it. It's really, really, really OK. You can definitely do it. So before you go into the exam, of course, you need to know your stuff. It's not going to be helpful if there are significant gaps in your learning. So there are three units in higher RMPS. There's the morality and belief unit. And what we do for this unit is relationships. This is the one that we have started. There's the world religion unit and we do Buddhism. And there's the religious and philosophical question unit and we do origins. Another word for origins is beginnings. So we look at the beginnings of life and the beginnings of the universe. So in terms of the questions that you get or the essay questions that you get for the morality and belief unit, you have one 10 marker question. Which assesses your KU and analysis. And you have one 20 marker question that assesses KU analysis and evaluation. OK, so it's two essays for one unit. Then for the world religion units for Buddhism, it is the same. You have one 10 marker question. Analyzing or marking the skills for KU and analysis and one 20 marker question, which is assessing your KU analysis and evaluation skills. So that is four essays. And that is one question paper. OK, so it's one question paper, two units. Then you come out of that first exam, that first question paper, you have a wee break. And then you go back into the exam hall and you do the second paper, which is one essay worth 20 marks for the origins unit. OK. The skills that we look at is KU, which stands for knowledge and understanding. Analysis, I'm going to tell you about that, and evaluation. Now, the evaluation skill is only for the 20 markers. OK, so for the 10 markers and you've got two of them. In the whole of the exam. The skills are KU and analysis and then for the 20 marker and you've got three of them, one for each unit, it's KU analysis and evaluation. Yep. OK. So I am going to just 
I'd like you in your own time to just look through this. Um, I think you can do that in your own time, no problem. I just want to go down to the bottom here and just talk about mirroring. OK, it's really important for you to mirror your question. When you mirror your question, what you're doing is you're just reflecting the question back in your answer. So, for example, this question here, analyze the moral debate surrounding sexual relationships. For mirroring the question, you would say, for example, there are many moral debates surrounding sexual relationships. This essay will focus on three moral issues, contraception, gay marriage and sex before marriage. Now, we've not done this part of the relationships course yet. We will. We are still to do sexual relationships and these different moral issues. But you will you can see what mirroring is. All is what you do is you just say the wording of the question in the first line of your answer. It is a really, really, really good habit to get into right now. And it's really good because it shows that you understand what is being asked, because of course you need to answer your question. It shows the marker that you know what direction the answer is going in. And really importantly, it stops you from wandering off in irrelevant waffle that wastes time and that you don't get marks for. Okay, so that is your first video on the overview of the skills. Thank you for listening.